Well, guys, it is May 24th, I believe. And today is a special day. I worked all day. Nothing special about today other than they drew archery elk tags in the Black Hills. And I finally drew my tag after 18 years. So uh, looking forward to that pretty uh, special hunt basically has become a once in a lifetime hunt and obviously we get to go on a lot of these hunts and we've helped a lot of people enjoy their once in a lifetime hunts it's still a pretty special day and I'm looking forward to it everything start to finish the scouting the hunting the whole nine yards so I think maybe mom had something to do with it upstairs looking over me so thanks mom try to uh, make you proud and uh, we'll see what shakes out this fall should be a good year Well guys, I am heading out on the first trail camera mission of the year. Drew my archery elk tag this year, so it's gonna be a grind. What we find now is not super good intel, but it it is helpful if you get a picture of a big velvet bull, because then you can kind of focus on like that five square mile area, maybe 10 square miles of country to try to pinpoint them later usually where they're at now is not where they are come September but it still gives you a pretty good gauge on what's out there sometimes you can stumble into a really big bull and then you just got to do some more legwork to figure out where he's actually hanging out come season but looking forward to this this is seriously a dream hunt we go elk hunting all the time obviously but it's the first time I've ever had a archery elk tag in my life actually and it's in the great state of South Dakota so how do you complain about that 18 year wait we are gonna get busy get some cameras up today it's gonna be a fun fun fall kick it off right now It seems kind of funny to focus on water right now. As much rain as we've had this year, but try to find the bigger bodies of water. Well, I'd say that's a good sign. I'm literally going to put the camera on that pond. There's a bull. Perfect. 
Well, last night I got a picture of a big bull, and I was just showing the boys, because I didn't show them yet. They said that he looked yummy, and we should shoot him, so... No, so far, he's number one on the list, so I'm, I would agree with them. And I don't think I could say no. And the same bull was in there last year, uh, right before season and into September, so it's a good sign that he's already there. Season will be here before we know. Got tacked this weekend, and then the scouting continues. It'll be a fun fall. Think I should get him? Yeah. No. All right see what we can do. Eighty-eight. All right. Here we go, that boys. Is long gone by now. Honey, that'll work. We're gonna have to give him a couple hours, but he'll die. Whoa. Back along. Had to be the wind. I think it's actually blowing that way, but nobody needs to know that, do they? <laughs> <laughs> I'll shoot him in Wyoming. Oh yeah, yeah for I'll sure. still shoot him. But oh, he's, he's got two busted G2s though. Yeah, that's not ideal. Back of the main beam's busted. <laughs> well, I just ditched the bike. Sucks because I could drive all the way to this camera, but legally I gotta leave it here, hike the rest of the way. So that's what we're gonna do. Usually not water in here. Such a wet ear. I feel like I'm getting a lot accomplished today so far, so it's a good feeling. Just got my ninth camera of the day situated. I think I'm gonna call it a day. Good day. Made some serious progress today. Feel pretty good about almost all the cameras that I put up. So that's a bonus. And it's time to head home. 85 degrees still. I am gonna hike up to my truck, point her home, and I think we're over halfway done with our chores. Season will be here before I know it. Pretty excited. Uh, this spot's pretty awesome. This whole thing right below this log right here and then right down below it always turns into a monster wallow. So I put a camera on this tree. There's no cell service here. We're about a month from wallow season, if you will. But natural travel, good water. The pond actually has water in it for the first time in like four years. I'm sure it'll dry up here soon, but it's good to see. Might make for some better uh, summertime pictures, so. I'm gonna bomb out of here and uh, see if I see anything driving out. It's gonna be getting dark on me here pretty quick, but might get lucky.
We're taking a break from elk scouting because we knew that we would never make it up here once the elk start bugling. So we're getting our cameras situated up in northern South Dakota. And uh, it's very big. Northwest. Northwest South Dakota. It is green as can be for August. This is pretty much unheard of in this country. So kind of looking forward to this year. I'm not sure how much we'll deer hunt because elk are on the brain. But we'll get time later at some point. We got some chores to get done. Austin and I are out scouting and we just got to the spot where we were gonna go check some cameras and we have a monster storm coming in on us and most of the storms today have been dropping like golf balls and tennis balls so hopefully this one doesn't. Lots of hail this year. I don't know I can't look at radar but I think that the big hail is probably that way. Guess we'll find out here in a minute. She comes. Yeah. Well, the storm passed. So we're gonna go check those cameras quick. The big hail missed us, so just a quick shot of rain and some pea-sized hail. We dodged a bullet. It is a beautiful morning. I just saw three small bulls up above this spring valley. A little cold front came in. It's high 70 today. It was 102 days ago, so we have a little later morning movement, but who knows? Season's knocking on the door, though. excited.
check the cameras. wants to go over to his girlfriend's over here. I was doing it back to him. That's where all the dust is coming from. <laughs> see an elk because we didn't yesterday. Brett is going to try to see if anything will talk back to him. Let's hear your bugle, buddy. <coughs> now do the chuckle. <coughs> okay, now let Rich do one. Okay, Rich, your turn. Chocolate mouth. <coughs> Pretty good. Did you hear any answer? See it? That's an elk. Yeah. Yeah. See it? Yeah. The bigger bulls should be showing up very soon. It's getting real. Austin and I are heading out Thursday. I believe it'll just be us and maybe my pops the first couple days and then Kenzie's meeting us at L camp so we'll see how long it takes to get her done you always hope that it takes probably like two three weeks if you can hunt that much and get all that extra experience but at the same time you can't pass up the opportunity when it is presented so you never know it could be the first morning it could be the last morning but we are looking forward to it for sure. So we'll see what shakes out. Hopefully uh, find a few elk this morning. Good, I just need to get a little better look. <laughs> 